GLP-1 receptor agonists have also been shown to reduce cardiovascular mortality. That started with the LEADER trial, again, a trial that was designed to look at cardiovascular safety uh, uh, as mandated by the FDA for all new diabetes drugs. And to everyone's uh, surprise and honestly delight, there was a reduction in cardiovascular mortality associated with the use of GLP-1 agonist. That was uh, uh, with liraglutide, uh, and then a, a subsequent study was done uh, uh, with a, uh, a newer analog uh, uh, in the sustained study, also corroborating the same results, reduction in cardiovascular risk. Uh, so these are drugs that have a number of benefits. They improve glucose control, they lead to some weight loss, uh, and now they also reduce cardiovascular disease and mortality. And so uh, really if you're, and, and they do all this in a way that doesn't lead to hypoglycemia. In a sense, if you're looking for a drug for diabetes, this class really is uh, ideal in many ways. Uh, the one challenge with it is it requires injection, but interestingly in the LEADER trial where they looked at quality of life of uh, uh, patients that were either on liraglutide or placebo, those that were on liraglutide actually had no worse quality of life. They were injecting a medication on a daily basis, but it didn't seem to impact their quality of life. And one wonders whether that was because of the weight loss effect that people were happy about and it offset the uh, inconvenience of doing injections. Obesity is one of the biggest challenges in the management of type 2 diabetes, and uh, it's been very difficult to find strategies that are effective. Lifestyle uh, efforts are important uh, and recommended and probably underutilized and underemphasized and require a multidisciplinary approach, but in the absence of that being effective, we need to think about other therapies. Uh, if we were looking for something that would be ideal for the treatment of diabetes, we'd look for something that would uh, improve glucose control, uh, that would not cause hypoglycemia, and because obesity is so common, to also reduce weight and certainly not lead to weight gain as the sulfonylureas uh, uh, can do. And, and those three qualities uh, are exactly what the GLP-1 agonists do. And, and then one, uh, added bonus beyond all of that is not only do you have the, the better glucose control uh, and, the, and the weight loss, uh, but you also have a reduction in cardiovascular mortality uh, that's been shown now in two studies.